Hello everyone, Namaskar, Rajkrishna this side and today we are going to solve one more problem from limits. So we have to solve limit x tending to 0, 1 minus cos x divided by x square. Pause the video and give it a try at least one or two times by yourself, try to solve this. If not, then unpause the video and look at the solution. It's simple and sometimes we remember this the solution of this limit also uh, at least the result whatever will come we remember to use this in bigger problems okay although it is not mandatory to learn this but yes if you want to solve problems faster in uh, exams involving mcq then you need to remember the result as well so let's uh, move with the problem so we know that one minus cos 2x is 2 sin square x whatever angle is there that will be half and we will move to square okay so power has increased okay so if we similarly want to write for 1 minus cos x so 2 will always be there, sin square will always be there, x was there, now it will become half, so x by 2, fine. So let's write that, so limit x tending to 0, in numerator we can write 2 sin square x by 2 divided by x square. Now we know limit x tending to 0 sin mx by mx gives you 1. So if I want to create the same, so limit x tending to 0, 2 can move out. This I can write as sin x by 2 divided by x now wait uh, this whole square I can write ok this is same as writing sin square x by 2 divided by x square but the problem is that we have coefficient of x which is which I have referred to m in this problem as half so what we have to do we have to multiply and divide by 2 okay so uh, this will be if I divide here by 2 now it's perfectly fine but for that I would have multiplied also by 2 fine to the Till this step it is fine but we don't want any extra term with mx. I only want x by 2. So I have to move this 2 out. So when this 2 will go out this will go as 1 by 4 because it is in denominator so 1 upon and this 2 will go out as 2 square. So 2 divided by 2 square limit x tending to 0 sin x by 2 divided by x by 2. Now you will say that this formula is valid only uh, for power 1 but you are uh, are you going to use this on square also? Uh, if uh, the limit x tending to 0 if this limit x tending to 0 sin x by 2 divided by x by 2 is defined we all know that this is equal to 1 so we have to check do two things first this inside limit should be defined and what is the function inside which this limit is there the function is square function so we need to check whether that is continuous or not if yes then we can move inside and this is 1 by 2 this limit can move inside so limit x tending to 0 
sin x by 2 divided by x by 2 square. Now this you all know is going to be 1. So you are finally going to get 1 by 2 into 1 square and this gives you 1 by 2. So that's how easy it was and I, as I told you we remember results sometimes so this is equal to half we remember for solving bigger problems. So you may add this to your formula notebook otherwise uh, we just use some algebra of limit that limit can go inside provided whatever is inside when limit will go is giving you some value finite value and other thing we have to check is that fun whatever function inside which you are going to take limit should be continuous. Okay, so that's it. This problem was I think uh, easy from that point of view. Do uh, share this problem with your friend and visit my playlist on limits for solving more such problems. Thanks and have a nice day.